A Native American film based on the Minnesota book award-winning novel will make its way back to Bemidji and other cinemas in the Lakeland viewing area next week. Reporter Destiny Wiggins has the details. With being in theaters for almost four years now, neither Wolf nor Dog, based on an award-winning novel, has a great deal of history within the Bemidji community. Neither Wolf nor Dog was written in Bemidji by the author uh, Kent Nurburn, who'd lived there for many, many years. And it, it sort of came about quite organically. He had worked with youth up in the Red Lake Indian Reservation on a book project where he took them out and they interviewed elders and he helped them distill um, the elders sort of take on things into a book. And then he was approached by one elder in particular who wanted him to do something similar. And uh, he thought, well, what's the best way of doing that? So he created a, a narrative of a road trip. The film's journey began in Bemidji, which is one of the first cities to debut the film at a CEC theater. White people won. It was a victory. When we won, it was a massacre. When they fought for freedom, it was a revolution. And when we fought for freedom, it was an uprising. Did you write these, Dan? I got lots more. It was a phenomenon when it played in Bemidji. We had 1,600 admissions. And when you think what the population of the town is, I don't know, 15,000, something like that. Um, and that really helped enormously in propelling the movie out. Um, other theaters in the area started thinking, well, there's something in this. Special screenings will be at multiple cinemas in the Lakeland viewing area, including Baxter, Grand Rapids, and Bemidji. Screenings will be on multiple days at multiple times with hopes of keeping the movie in the cinemas for at least two weeks. The other thing that's crucial to this film's success is that it's been a community effort. We have a massive support, um, a very active support in social media. People reach out and engage with us, and they sense the importance of it. The film is crowdfunded. Um, so it was supporters of my previous Native works and, and also Kent Nurburn's works that, that really made it happen. The film has also played in other states such as North and South Dakota and has had over 100,000 in ticket sales and counting. Reporting in Bemidji, Destiny Wiggins, Lakeland News. And you can visit CEC Theater's website to watch the movie's full trailer. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.